character sheets are a powerful tool in the Kanka marketplace, which allows you to combine HTML, CSS and attributes on entities to create fully customized character sheets for the various tabletop RPGs you wish to play. If you are playing a system which doesn't yet have a character sheet in the marketplace, you can create your own, and we'll go over some of the core features of this tutorial. First, head over to marketplace.kanka.io and log in using your normal Kanka account. In the Your Plugin section, you can create a new plugin. In this case, we shall give it a name, and the plugin type you will select Character Sheet. Since Character Sheets aren't multilingual, the plugin language is important so that others can find a language which suits their needs. Create the plugin to start creating a character sheet. A plugin is then split into various versions, so let's create our first version. This is where the magic happens. Let's give our version a name, so 1.0, and a short description. The HTML content field will define how your plugin renders. So let's create a short example here. I've created this short HTML, which will simply display the name of the entity and then some attributes, and then the HP attribute, level attribute, and if the focus point attribute is not empty, meaning more than zero, it will show that information too. You can see I've prefixed all my classes with JTest. This is a good practice to avoid overlapping classes between your character sheet and the Kanker CSS. On the supported syntax and help link below the field, you can get information on which syntax is available and how to use some special features like loops and conditions. Next up is the CSS. Let's quickly write some CSS. With my ugly CSS now created, let's add some attributes. In the HTML, I referenced name, HP, level, and focus points. Name will automatically be mapped to the entity's name, so we don't need to create that attribute. HP, level, and focus points need to be added, so let's quickly add those. I've added level as a number attribute, which will limit it to only contain numbers. HP is a calculation of my level times five, and focus points is a random field, which when it's applied to a character, select a value between zero and 10. Let's create this version. Now, character sheets need to be reviewed by the Kanka admin team before being available to all. However, due to the complexity of creating complex character sheets, you can already install this plugin into one of your campaigns by clicking the Install button. In this case, I will install it in my Taelia campaign, and it's now being installed. Now I can go back to my campaign and apply this character sheet to one of my characters. On my test character here, I am on the Attributes subpage. I will click on Apply an Attribute Template, and this list now has this test character sheet by J, which is the name of the character sheet from the marketplace. With the character sheet applied, it is now rendering on my entity. Since this character sheet is a draft, only I, as the plugin creator, can actually see it. I can now go back to the marketplace and edit it without having to reapply it or update it while it's in draft status to directly see updates in the interface. I've simply added, have a nice day at the end of the hello. We'll save it and go and see how it looks now in the interface. Back in Kanker, I refresh the page and I can now see have a nice day. You might be wondering why it's displaying hello underscore layout. I referenced the name attribute, which is supposed to be mapped to the entity's name. However, I was wrong. This doesn't exist. This might exist by the time you watch this video, but at the time of recording this, you cannot reference a entity's name directly in the character sheet. Once you are happy with the way your character sheet renders, you can submit it for review. The Kanker team usually takes a couple of hours to a couple of days to review a character sheet, and you will automatically get an email if we approve it or reject it. If you have more questions about character sheets, hop into our Discord and someone from the team or the community will quickly respond to you.